Hey everybody, it's Sarah, and um, this is yet another drain update. Um, I had two drains remaining. Um, the fourth drain came out last night, which leaves the third drain in, which is the one that I had problems with earlier this week. Um, it's... I'm having problems with it again because the fourth drain came out. So um, once that hole starts closing up from the fourth drain, the third drain will start working again. But in the meantime, uh, Dr. Katzen said, I emailed him last night and I woke up to a response. He had actually responded to me like 15 minutes after I had emailed him last night, late last night. and. Um, and uh, he got back to me right away. So um, he had said, do whatever it takes to keep the, for the last drain in. He said, tape it to yourself, do whatever you have to do to keep the last drain in. He's like, I can't stress to you the importance of this. Um, so now I'm like really nervous because I'm obviously having an issue with these drains. They're like stitched in. They're supposed to be stitched in, but so far it's like, I'll like look down and it's like coming out. So, um, and for those of you who I guess don't know or don't realize, the, um, the drains are in the pubic region. Um, it's like four holes they, that they put in the drains, and it's like, now that the drains are coming out, I look like a bowling ball, but, um, so I have the last drain in, and I have to, like, do whatever I can to leave it in, and I'm just, I'm really scared now, so I actually have, have it depends on, because, um, I had those from after surgery, I had some left over, uh, because, the hole from the fourth drain is leaking fluid so until that starts closing up the other drain is not working so I'm just leaking and uh, just, the drains are just so frustrating um, my incision is healing up wonderfully um, I did email him because I'm having some irritation in my belly button my new belly button um, so I have to email a picture to him to, uh, have him take a look at it to see what I should do with it. And also, um, I'm sorry. <sighs> also, um, he told me to stay off of my buttocks because in the email I was explaining to him how I'm having just lots of pain and lots of discomfort in my tailbone. Um, I had an issue the day that we traveled back from California. Um, it just really felt like my tailbone was like bruised. It hurt. Kind of like it's hurting now. Um, but way worse. <laughs> and uh, I got home and looked in the mirror and realized there was a bruise on around my tailbone. And and, um, so I stayed off of my, my bottom, off of my butt for several days. I laid on my sides. I sat on my sides and, you know, and now, I'm oh, sorry, it's early. I didn't get much sleep because I was nervous about this drain. Um, but now I... I'm having the discomfort again so he said once again to stay off of my butt to lay on my sides he said don't lay on my stomach because it's gonna put uh, pressure on the last drain so I'm only allowed to stay on my sides this is day number 23 without a shower 
I've been washing my hair in the sink and doing sponge baths, which, you know, is it's part of the process, but, um, and normally, if it, if the surgery wasn't, like, as intense as mine was, um, or stressful on my body, I guess, as mine was, um, I would have had the drains out maybe a week or two ago, and I would have already been showering, but, um, there's so much fluid still in there because they just, it was such a, like, I don't know the word, intense, um, such a severe surgery, such a massive, I don't know, I don't really know how to explain it, but, um, yeah, it's, uh, intense. <laughs> Excuse me. So, today I guess I'm laying on my sides. I have my last drain taped to me because I'm scared to death of it coming out. And that's that. Now I gotta take a picture of my belly button and send it to Dr. Katzen. So, um, Sally. I saw your video and I am totally feeling your pain. Literally. <laughs> um, the incision like rests like right at the top of the butt crack. So it meets there right at the top and that's like right where my tailbone is. So I it's, the incision is sore, a little bit sore, but it's like inside. It feels like bruised or something, I don't know. So, I don't know. I'm going to chill today, I guess, again. But I just wanted to document this and let you guys know what's going on, and I will update you as soon as I can. So, please send your prayers my way, send your prayers Sally way, Sally's way. Um, hope for a fast recovery. So I will talk to you guys later. Mm -hmm. Bye.